Hello friends, we are going to learn about circular scan descheduling algorithm. So here, what we have to do, as you can see here, Q is given from 98 to 67. Uh, all the elements or we can say track is given and head starts at 53 and the range is given from 0 to 199. All these things are given. So what we have to do in circular scan, it it is just similar like scan, but it has circular effect. What does it mean? You have to go to one extreme position and by traversing all the elements, then you have to traverse back to the other end. And then you have to follow the same direction which you have started initially and traverse the remaining element. Okay. So as you can see, we are now at 53. So the distance between 65 and 53 is less in comparison to 37. So we have chosen this direction. Now we are moving towards right end as we have chosen the right direction. So we are in count traversing all the elements which encounter in our path in, in uh, encountering our path from 53 to 1 and that is 199. So we are traversing all the elements from 53, 53 to the 199. So as you can see 65, 67, 98, 122, 124, 183 and now we reach to the end 199. So we have traversed all the elements which encounter in our path from 53 to 199 or the one of the extreme end. Now we have to move to the other end. We don't have to follow any random order and we have to select 30 and 14. In circular scan algorithm, we have to switch circular effect. Therefore, you have to move to other end. So when you are at one end, so you have to come to other end that is zero. Then you have to follow the same direction which you have started initially. Therefore, we have we are going in this direction and traverse all the remaining elements. Therefore, we have traversed zero and 14. So once you have traversed all the elements, then you have to stop. As you can see, no elements are repeated here. So you have to traverse all the elements only once and as you have finished the as you have come to 37 and we have finished our journey journey so the operation is completed so this is known as circular scan algorithm i hope you like this video